tonight, a South Florida corrections officer finding himself on the wrong side of the law. He is now facing charges accused of attacking a handcuffed inmate. The apparent abuse caught on camera. Local 10 News reporter Amy Viteri is live in Homestead with the disturbing details. Amy. Well, that incident was all captured on surveillance video. As you say, during the booking process here at the Homestead Police Department, it captures a corrections officer shoving a handcuffed inmate headfirst into a concrete wall. The troubling video shows Homestead Corrections Officer Lester Brown escorting a handcuffed inmate into the booking area. Watch as Brown shoves the inmate from behind, sending him tumbling face first into a concrete wall, causing him to bleed from the head, requiring a trip to the hospital. Today, we are charging Homestead Police Officer Lester Brown with felony battery, and a th which is a third degree felony, and official misconduct, which is also a third degree felony. It happened in December. The inmate, Jose Garcia Alvarado, was arrested for disorderly intoxication and resisting arrest without violence. Miami-Dade State Attorney Catherine Fernandez Rundle says Officer Brown lied on his written report about the incident, claiming Alvarado was combative and tried to attack officers. She said video contradicts those claims, showing Alvarado calmly walking in without a struggle. Brown also claimed the inmate fell forward into the wall. No one answered the door at Brown's house in Homestead Wednesday night. It's very surprising to hear and, you know, very unfor unfortunate. People who live nearby describe Brown as a great neighbor who's helpful and kind. They were surprised to learn of the allegations and see the video. Yeah, it is tough to see that, like, you know, from one second to the next, you know what I mean? Like, you, your whole life changes. Brown is now charged with felony battery and official misconduct. Homestead's chief of police also condemning his officer's actions. We're not going to tolerate this kind of behavior from our police officers. And Brown's bond was set at $10,000, which he did post earlier today. The chief of police says he is now relieved of duty without pay. We will continue to follow this story. We're live in Homestead tonight. Amy Viteri, Local 10 News.